Hello everybody, this is Himsa. I'm going to be doing some strats for DE Inferno for you guys. So, we're going to start you off on Terrace as usual. Okay, of course you can go into A, or you can go into B. I'm going to start off walking y'all through A. Now A, after they did the update to this map, became a little bit more of a pain in the butt for the counter terrorists to defend. The purpose of them doing all these updates was to make this map more equally balanced. So, And they did a pretty good job on a couple different things. For one, this is an awesome pick spot for mid. You can easily get one or two, and especially since there's going to be an opera peak in that corner, to make sure you don't get out to mid. Now, I'm going to go over a smoke position here. Throw it over. It's gonna land. Couldn't have gotten more perfect than that. There's no way they can get you in mid. So, then you're gonna utilize two things. This is called banana. As you can tell, it's shaped like a banana. Yes. So, this is called log pile because it's logs and a pile. I know, I don't know where they came up with that, but, you know, we're just gonna have to make that work. So, what happens, you get two people stacked up on this. You jump on another person's head, if you see right there, if you if I'm standing on somebody's head, I can pick a person that's camping back a site. That is amazing how they added that. It's not illegal in any league yet, so definitely utilize that as much as possible. Now, when you're coming mid, you're going to have to look at two things. Behind car, you're usually going to have somebody there. If not, in this back banana corner, or tip of the banana, whatever you want to call it. It means the same thing, but for shift six, we're going to call it closet banana. That's what we'll call it. Now, before you cross, know that somebody could be right there it's that corner with an operator to get you and hug this wall if you're gonna rush B leave a pro sniper to do this jump because somebody's gonna be right there most of the time pick their head right off you're not gonna have to worry about getting shot now if you haven't noticed in the update they took there used to be a big generator right here no longer there they got rid of it because it was very very difficult for somebody to get somebody out of there on the terror side so might be a guy there might be a guy there regardless hug this wall now when you get to about here the next step you take you're gonna be visible to a couple different slots so take another step you become visible to that cubby hole somebody might be camping right there you go another step, there could be a guy right here. Guy on the, I mean, they can be anywhere in this bomb site. Also, which is awesome, you can no longer plant in the fountain. That's illegal in most leagues, and now these maps are being catered to a lot of leagues. You can no longer, I'm tr clicking right now if you can hear it. You cannot plant in the fountain, which is good for the fishes. Anyway, so, go over a couple places in A course you can hide behind the boxes now what's really funny is you get somebody that a team that knows that little trick to pop up and get somebody back a just wait for them and just pop their face off they get very upset they e-rage reminds me a lot like chitlins and league of legends but you, you get the drift so utilize this back part when when the bombs planted somebody needs to be in this corner somebody needs to be in that corner somebody needs to be in this corner, I split up. This is a beautiful site to defend when the bomb is down. So, now to go over a couple more positions over here. This is all considered banana from here all the way down to our spawn. You can do a little description if you get shot somewhere. This back there is considered CT spawn. When you plant the bomb, or whatever the case may be, Every once in a while, there will be an opera back here that rotates from B to start picking off terrorists. 
So be careful of this spot right here. It's right at their spawn. Also, what could happen? Somebody's right here in this truck waiting for y'all to turn that corner to get into the bomb site. So, of course, that's truck. This is tree hugger. As you can see, there is a tree. This long thing right here. Just wait, wait, wait to hear the sounds. Wait to hear the sounds. Pop out. Gone. And this is called church. Most people can, you know, think there's a cross somewhere. Oh. Okay, well, anyway, this is church. This is an A rotation spot. Okay, so that's the basic gist of A when it comes to banana. Which is really, this is one of the only maps where there's only one way into A unless you do a long rotation around the map. So A is really not a choice place, but at the same time they usually only have two people. They never stack up three people here. There's always the pigeon and the hunter at A. Okay, now I'm going to go over mid and B positioning. So, as I was telling you, utilize the mid smoke, which I'm not going to show you that again. Just going to go over some quick positions real quick. All this is called back alley. All up to the wall. Up to the apartment right there. Now, this is also a couple, this is choice for oppers, but you have to realize not a lot of pro teams will send the sniper there or there. Because a lot of pro teams will just camp in a corner at the bomb sites and wait for y'all to come to them. So, most, they're just either playing really aggressive, they're playing stupid, or they're just going to wait. So, I mean, really pick your poison. This is called Shack. This is something that Blaze would live in, as you can tell. There's this window right here. It's awesome for picking mid, but also at the same time it can backfire on you. Now, before the update, you couldn't crawl through the window. Now, thankfully, they added that. A lot of people complained about that. So, now you can get in and out of the window. But, be care very, very particular about this place. Maybe take one shot. If you miss it, get the hell out. So, now we're going to go many apartments. Many apartments, this. All of this is many apartments. This is bridge. This is mini apartment. Now, to utilize this, you got crawl space. And then right here at the corner, you can see people through that window. Or you can see them right here. It's not really easy for them to see you. Or you can crouch and just get ready for that quick pick at the corner. Now, say B is failing at a rush, and you need to switch really quickly to get over to A. Crawl space. Very convenient. Get to it. Get to where you need to go. Get up through banana. Now, something else. Right here at these pots, you can see right through the pots. Now, if you're, if you're a counter-terrorist and you're playing aggressive, Remember these spots, I'm telling you, because 9 times out of 10, there's going to be somebody there waiting for about 3 to 6 seconds, waiting for to see if somebody's going to make a pick or not. Oh, wrong door, sorry. So, now you're going to get into back hallway. This is back hall. All the way from there to there is back hallway. Even though you're in apartments, it's still considered back hallway. So, this door can lead out to it now, and it, it didn't used to before. Not that I remember. People argue with it, but people are with me, so really don't could care less. So, and this is garden. Get a couple things from here. Watch mid-rotation from here. This is stairwell. Now, about this, I'm just going to go around and show you real quick. A lot of CTs will do this. A lot of CTs will wait here, wait till they hear steps, come up, pop the crap out of you. It's very successful, and a lot of teams do do that. A way to counter that, which is pretty